chosen ones where you are 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 chosen ones back with another powerful and productive video someone is going to leave your life very soon yes because this someone is detrimental to your life this someone is toxic to your life this someone is not helping you grow all right so this someone is soon going to leave your life this someone is retarding your growth in life this someone is not helping you to become a better version of yourself this someone doesn't want you to become your true and authentic self in fact this someone is oppressing you this someone is keeping you in the darkness this someone doesn't want your star to shine doesn't want your light to shine this someone doesn't want the best for you in fact this someone is limiting you in so many things and keeping you to be stagnant in so many things this someone is giving you so much of near success syndrome because of this someone there is no elevation there is no expansion there is no growth there is no, there is no development there is no increase in your life and you know since this someone is in your life there is no growth there is stagnation there is limitation there is near success syndrome there is no expansion you yourself you can testify to this that the moment this person entered your life nothing is moving anymore nothing is growing nothing is advancing nothing is everything is just static all right it's like you are enduring each and every day you are exhausted you are tired of yourself because of this someone that is in your life because of this someone that is in your cycle nothing is moving nothing is growing all right I'm telling you, this someone is going to leave your life very soon. God, the universe, is aware of whatever is going on. And the universe knows, God knows how to remove this someone from your life to have your peace of mind and your peace of heart so that you will have the advancement you're supposed to have, the growth that you are supposed to have the increased abundance for it to happen in your life because this someone is keeping you at where you do not belong oh i pray for you i pray for you someone i pray that whatever is keeping you where you do not belong should lose their grips over you should lose their grips on you should lose their grips over your life because you are really suffering you are really going through a lot you are suffering because they are keeping you where you do not belong you are supposed to be in your glorious destiny right now to be enjoying to be in your land of milk and honey but because of this someone in your cycle things are stagnant things are not okay things are not all right all because of this someone chosen one all right don't worry. Worry not. Fear not. God knows how to deal with this someone. God knows how to remove this someone from your life. The universe knows how to disconnect you from this someone in your life. All right? So leave everything to God. Leave everything to the universe. And all I want you to do, my little advice I will give to you as a chosen one, is that don't quit. Don't stop working on yourself. Okay? Don't stop striving to become a better version of yourself don't stop doing you and being you don't stop all right because as you working on yourself i'm telling you the fire of the holy ghost is going to take over you and you are going to be in the form of the holy ghost and that fire will not be convenient anymore for this someone in your life. The fire of the Lord in your life will drive this someone away out of your life. The fire of the Lord in your life will push this someone away from your life. The fire of the Lord in your life will make this person to pull away from you because the fire will be so much to be consuming this person in your life. Okay? So, 
when they are trying to live your life, when they are packing, when they are pulling away, don't try to reconnect with them. Don't try to be desperate, to be needy, to be miserable, to be begging them. It is God that is removing them. It is the universe that is removing them. It is the fire of the Holy Spirit, of the Holy Ghost that is burning in you, that is making them uncomfortable. It is tormenting their evil spirit in them. And that is making them not to be comfortable with you. All right. And they will live your life. By the fire of the Holy Ghost, they will leave. By the fire of the Holy Ghost, they will disappear. By the fire of the Holy Ghost, they will run away. By the fire of the Holy Ghost, they are certainly going to pull away from your life. All right? Keep making God your priority. Keep putting God first. Have love for God. And remember that every relationship starts with the love of God. And that relationship will definitely, the love that you have for God, is the love that will overflow to people. So put God first in whatever you do. And I'm telling you, God knows of your situation. God knows of what you're going through. God knows of this person. God knows of what this person is doing in your life. God knows that the, the, the things this person is depriving you of, God knows of it. And God is going to remove that in your life. And when that person is removing your life, you will be free. You will be set free. You will be decreed free. You will achieve great things. You will be successful. You will be a victor. You will be the head. You will be a leader. You will be. You you will just do well. You will, you will do great. Your star will shine. You will see yourself being elevated. You will see you doing great things. You will see yourself achieving great things, and you yourself you will be astonished. You'll be surprised. You'll be amazed what has become of you. This someone is living your life very, very soon, I tell you, because they are toxic. They are wicked. This person is so wicked, not wanting anything good for you. They always happy when you are going through the misfortune. They always happy when you are going through the pain. They always happy. When you are not happy, they are happy. That is what makes them happy. But they are living a pretentious life. They are pretending as if they love you, as if they care for you, as if they are with you in the, whatever you're going through. But they are the very people that are oppressing you. They are the very people that are bringing you down. They are the very people that are toxic. They are the very people that are detrimental to your growth, to your well-being in this life. The universe will remove them out of your life. God will remove them out of your life. So keep working on yourself, as I said. And I tell you, when you work on yourself, the Holy Spirit that dwells in you, the Holy Ghost fire will consume all of them out of your life. I'm telling you, you need to be on fire. You need to be on fire. And when you are on fire, there is no limitation. You got to be a Holy Ghost naked wire, all right? And they dare not touch you. That is who you got to be. So keep working on yourself. A time is coming. They will live your life and you will be free. I tell you, everything under the sun has an expiring date. Their time will come. And this is their time. Their time is up. They will live your life. I'm telling you. All right, expect that it will certainly happen, but don't just sit there, keep working on yourself, your shortcomings, your weakness, your limitations. Keep working on it. I'm telling you, God will do the rest. All right, great. See you in my next video. I'm out for now.